listen um let this resonate with whoever it needs to resonate resonate with like one thing that i'm gonna say um i'm in a place where i don't care how you feel about me i don't care what you think about me and i don't care what you say about me i just don't care anymore so your opinion your indirects your whatever are irrelevant they just bounce off i really don't care second of all for so many years for so many years i held back a lot a lot a lot i just blend in on tr or try to be like everybody else so kept my mouth shut just to avoid problems to avoid just spare people's feelings or whatever because you know people are too naive and sensitive to certain things i don't care about that no more like I, I meant what i said when i said that i'm gonna speak as blunt as i want to so if something i write or talk about or share you don't like keep it moving keep it moving i share and say what i say because i know there's people that want to do better but doesn't don't know how or haven't been shown how or things they need they need to know they don't they don't know and i also share my my own journey my own experiences because i know like i say i know what it feels like to need help and not have it i know what it feels like to be misguided misled misled i know what that feels like and nobody physically in this world walking this damn earth has ever helped me in my darkest moment at all not even when i was going through my darkest darkest and hardest painful painful freaking moments nobody physically nobody all my healing all my help has come from the spiritual realm so i don't give rats behind what anybody thinks about me or say about me if anything i post or say or speak about bothers anybody guess what the issue is with you it's within you i'm disturbing your demons go heal go become a better person let it resonate what i share and let it let it help you become a better person i'm far from perfect but damn it i'm healing and i have changed a lot out of my life because i honestly want better for my life and i want to become a better person but one thing i learned this healing journey i know who the fuck i am and what i am and i'm not staying quiet for nobody like i said before i'm not sparing nobody's feelings so if the truth, or if you condemn the truth, better to say, then stay away out of my, stay out of my page, stay out of my stories, stay out of my posts, stay out of my life. My conversations are not the same anymore. Can't be around low frequency people. I can't be around toxic people. I just can't. You believe in what you want to believe, but we cannot hang together. When your mind evolves and your mind matures. There's new things you have to do. And the old shit is no longer. And like I say, I always do shadow work. I look within. And whatever I need to fix, whatever I need to heal, I heal. I don't want to be part of this world. I'm not part of this world. I don't want to blend in with your, with your trends, with your challenges, with your lifestyle. I don't want to be. I'm not that. That's not me. And I'm not staying quiet. Like I said, I'm not staying quiet. I don't care. Like, I don't care. You can't hurt a person that doesn't care. So if y'all think for one second, y'all indirects or y'all saying something to me that y'all don't want to agree with what I'm saying, it's going to affect me anyway. It's not, sweetie. It's not at all. It just shows who you really are. And a lot of y'all need to heal. And I don't care what anybody say about, oh, she thinks she better because, no, I, well, you know what? I am better. I am better than you. And like I stated before, and you're better than yourself. You just refuse to become and revolve to the greater you that you know that you are. So I can't be around that fuckery. So if I say no, it's no. My energy, my time has to be respected. And if you can't respect it, keep it moving. Keep it moving. My mental state my energy, 
my worth will will be respected and will be valued. Trust me, I am protected. I am protected from forces and powers that this world is not even is not even ready to deal with. I don't fuck with witchcraft. I don't do that. Good or bad, how people say they all come from, from Satan. I don't do none of that. I walk in the spirit, not the flesh. It's a difference. If it bothers you so much, my existence bothers you so much, or it disturbs your demon, you need to go heal. It's you. You're the issue. You're the problem. You got guilty conscience. You got things to get out of your chest. And it's, like I said, it's not only for my posts. If anybody's posts or stories or the way they talk bothers you, you're the problem. You need to go heal. You have an ugly heart and you're making yourself look like you're such a humble, humble and kind person. But to a person like me, I could read people's energy just from a picture. So this is why you people really don't barely see me because I can't be around people. I just can't. Low frequency people, like I can't. That sucks the life out of you. That that drains the energy out of you. I can't be around those type of people no more. I can because that's not me anymore. I can't be around that stuff. So if y'all want to be doing the same fuckery shit I've been doing for the for your entire life, fine, go ahead. Just like I said, just all any any. Let me let me say this before I end it. Any ill wishes or any evil thoughts that you try to throw my way, trust me, it's gonna go. It's gonna bounce back a hundred times worse. Because, like I say, I'm very well protected by higher powers, and I'm constantly healing. I'm actually in a in a deep healing right now for two weeks. I don't play with my life anymore. I don't. I don't play my life, and I don't waste my life anymore. I know what I am, and I, I know what I'm capable of doing. And manifesting and creating. So I don't have time. I don't have time to sit there and and and, and keep com keep the miserable ones company and keep the toxic people company like I used to before. No, like I say, I'm speaking my mind. I'm speaking how I want to say. It. I'm gonna say it if I need to say it. I'm gonna say it. I don't care how you feel about it. I don't. I don't care. I don't care. Keep it moving. I don't care. I don't care. Call me toxic. Call me miserable. Call me bitter. Come and call it whatever you want to call it. Like I said, those words, when you start saying those words to me or anybody else that speaks their mind, remember, that's a reflection of who you are. Of who you are. If it hits you, if something you read hits you, and it constantly, you put a whole mean face, like, who the hell did this person think they are? It's you. It's your demon. We disturbed your demons. So go heal. Go heal. And create a better life for yourself. And if you have children, for your children as well, go heal. Because this world is already full of of ignorant, naive, sensitive, demonic humans. And it's it's sickening. It's sickening. Like I'm already tired of it. And I cannot wait for paradise to be created on earth already and get rid of these people already because I'm tired of it. So next time you want to say something, and next time y'all want to say something about me or think about me, remember, she doesn't care. She doesn't care. I don't care. It doesn't bother me. Like It really doesn't bother me. Another thing I forgot to mention, if you don't like me, if you dislike me, don't say don't say hi to me. Don't say a word to me if you when you see me. Don't. Because that hypocrisy, I see it. And I don't I don't like it. I don't like it. Just because I say hi back is because that's the kind way to do it. I'm not ignorant. Far from it. I'm not rude neither. You say hi to me, I'm gonna say hi back, but if you know damn well you dislike me, don't say anything to me. You don't have to speak my way. You don't have to I mean you don't have to look my way or say a word to me. I don't care. Like I really don't care. I don't understand what part I don't care the people don't understand. Or get. I don't care. I don't care. I got family members that don't speak to me. I got family members that turn their back on me. I got family members that ill wish my name and I don't care. I don't care about the next person. I don't. So just keep it moving. Keep it pushing. I value myself. I love myself more than I ever thought possible. Like, and like I said, I value my energy, value my time, my worth. And if you can't match my energy, then I don't need you. I don't need you around me. 
And like I said, opinions are irrelevant. I don't care anymore. I'm not who I used to be before. I'm not who I was before. Mm -mm. I heal, I release, I rise, and I continue to rise. I'm not watering myself down for nobody. I don't care who doesn't like it. Like, I love being alone. I like the peace. I like who I am, who I have become, and the greatness that I'm becoming, because the best is still yet to come. So, like I said, um, you have to look within instead of pointing a finger. I don't care. Which is insane that people, you know, call this, you know, being blunt and, and sharing wisdom and stuff like that, you know, being bitter, being miserable, being everything, everything in the books. But when I was toxic and doing toxic fuckery with y'all, it was all high five and laughter and, and chilling and all. It was cool. But when you switch your life around, people hate that. People doesn't people don't like that. Why? Simply because they're still stuck doing the same thing they've been doing since they were born. And it irritates their demons to see you do better. It irritates the demons they to see you break free from the system. It irritates them. And I'm not going to pull a chair around and sit next to you. If you refuse to be set free, then that's your business. But I'm not saying I'm not keeping you company. I'm not. So call it what you want. I don't care. And I'm going to continue to say I don't care because I honestly don't care. And I wish people would understand that I don't care. I don't care about you your opinion of me. I don't care. I honestly don't care. Keep it pushing. Like I say, keep it pushing. I share wisdom for those that need it, for those that want it, to the best of my knowledge. And like I say, I don't walk in the flesh. I walk in the spirit. So all my information comes from higher powers. Everything that I know comes from nature. It's being taught me. It's just it's something that I can't explain until you yourself experience it. So just know that what I speak on, what I share, my beliefs, everything, it doesn't come from a fleshy more the body. It comes from a spiritual realm. It comes from a higher power. So like I said, this me, this who I am, I value dearly. I love dearly. And like I said, the best is still yet to come because I'm still healing. You know, I'm trying to be as my highest frequency I could possibly be. I'm trying to be, I'm, I'm being the best me that I could possibly be. I'm not walking in nobody's shadow. Like I said, if you want to be a follower, that's a, that's on you. That's your life, your opinion, or whatever. You keep doing you. But, like I said, is people being naive and sensitive, it's not going to stop me from speaking. Because there is people out there that want to seek the truth but don't know where to start. Or they want help to change their life or whatever, don't know where to start. And I know my posts and my journey and my results has inspired a lot of people because I get people besides the trolling and besides the indirects and you know the shit talkers I get DMs from positive people that actually tells me themselves like they, they love my vibe they love how I change my life around and how you know I inspire them to become better and that is my per one of my purpose you know I can't admit to my wrongs. That's why I work on it. That's why I heal. That's why I detox. That's it. But nobody's taking, I'm not allowing anyone to take that from me. Not, nobody, not my husband, not my children, not my family, not nobody. Nobody's taking who I have, or who I am becoming and who I am now from me. Nobody, like I say. Not allowing no vampires, blood sucking, energy draining people in this system get the best of me anymore. My time, like I said, is valued. And if you don't value my time, keep it pushing. That's it. I have a lot of self-respect, a lot of it. And like I said, I love myself more than I ever did in my life. And I love where I'm at. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love being blunt. I love speaking my mind. I love, I love it. I love it. I don't miss nothing from my past. Nobody from my past whatsoever. I just regret not being who I was supposed to be like who my true self that's it that's the only thing everything else is just it was just lessons messages 
and purpose and destinations. That's it. And I enjoy every moment of it. So, like I say, let this resonate to whoever it needs to resonate on. And if it's not, if it doesn't bother you, if it doesn't face you what I'm saying, then, you know, more power to you. Rise up. But if this video disturbs you, you got healing to do.